Hey guys, it's Amy from Amy's Little Bit of Everything. How you doing? Jazz hands. You know you guys want to do it back, don't you? Jazz hands. <laughs> Alright, I'm a little weird, but oh well. Well, welcome to my channel, and thank you, and somebody's been liking, um, subscribing, sharing, all that stuff, because I'm getting more and more um, subscribers, and I really appreciate it, because I really want to reach a lot of people. Um, I generally just do a little bit of everything, that's why I named it this channel, and I want to thank you, and I love all the comments. You guys are so kind. Everybody kept saying, be careful with the YouTube channel, everyone's so mean. I've just had like those one or two. You know, and they weren't really mean. It was just, I, I might have, I'm, I take things sometimes harder than what they really are meant to be. But I love it. You guys, and it seems like you guys know, like if I'm having a down day, yesterday was bad. I was, I was not feeling well yesterday. I could not hardly function. But today I'm back up. I've been canning. I got some canning videos that's getting ready to download and come out. And, oh, and I wanted to show you my hair. These are from Timu. They're little clips. I should have brought a, another one to show you what it looked like. But um, they're clips, and then you pull your hair through. I'm learning how to do it. And my hair is so soft right now, it just kind of comes, like, right back out. But they're staying pretty good. I wish I had them down a little bit closer, but it's my first time using them. I've had them for a while, and I got these little pokey things that are poking out. <laughs> but um, I've had them for a while. I just, you know, didn't use them. But, um... But yeah, oh, I want to show you my shirt. That's my, I got two black labs. One's Bo and one's Luke. I was hoping I could find a shirt that had two of them on there. Because I like it better when it's like that. But I don't care. It's my Bobo and Lukey. And over here's my Cujo. Cujo! Right there. Tickle, tickle, tickle. <laughs> I love you, buddy. You want to get this party started? Let's get this party started. All right, guys. I did sign up with Timu, but I don't know how long I'm going to do this. Um, and nothing to do with them or anything. Um, I just don't know where the company's going to go or what's going to happen. Or, you know, about, you know, if they raise their prices. I've heard some things about that. So, I'm just going to take it a day at a time. And I'm not fancy. I haven't been able to post it um, up on my... Um, to link it or anything in my description, but I'll also put this in my description below. Um, I'd like to be able to um, somehow, you know, how people run it across their screen or they get all fancy and everything. Well, I'm not fancy. I try to be fancy, but I'm not fancy. I try, but anyways. All right, but I'm feeling so much better today. Yesterday, I couldn't do nothing. Even if the mailman would have came and had 10 boxes of Timu, I would have said, we gotta do it tomorrow because I just don't have strength. I got up, I was able to fix food for me and Jeff, and, and he, I didn't even have to do that. And, um, and then, um, what else? Oh, I showered, and that was about it. Basically, do the dishes that we did with our food, and that was it, because I was just wiped out. But anyways, um, but, you know, I'm all right. I'm better today. I've been bouncing off the walls. I got my Predna zone going on, got my inhaler going on. So I did my canning, I'm doing this. I might clean a little bit, but yeah, that's about it. And thanks, <coughs> thanks for sharing and liking and commenting. Oh my gosh, I have such good people. Um, they, everybody was saying, be careful with um, um, YouTube because you get like enemies or mean people. I maybe had a couple and that wasn't even anything bad. I mean, and I'm, I'm pretty grown up. I can pretty well take it. But, you know, everybody gets, you know, it's kind of sensitive sometimes when you're like, oh, that's my me, or oh, that's my animal, or, you know, something like that. But anyways, I'm rattling. Let's get this party started and get on with the show. Alrighty, we got a Timu order. I'm going to start with these things that I had no idea what they were when I opened them. I can't even put them in my hand and show you. I was like... I saw, like, I don't know if I can get it in there, like, this little arrow pointing one way. I saw these dots on here, and I got two red, two white, and I guess I got one black. And I had no idea what they were. And I thought, why did I order these? Well, I ran off my, my sheet of um, item details. It's a beverage lid can caps. Oops, hold on. That's the last of my tomato juice. I'll be right back. 
I'm back. Did you miss me? Hope so. I missed you. Okay, that's annoying. And I say it every time. I can't help it. It's like something inside me just says, you've got to do this. And I got this glare of me coming back in my glasses. Maybe that's a little better. I'll move over. Don't mind me. Okay. <laughs> it's still in my glasses. Okay, I'm just gonna stay here. Uh, I like it better over here. Let me move over a little bit. Okay, what this is, this was a beverage can lid cap. It's reusable, protects for bug-free drinks. So when you have your can, and of course I didn't bring a can in here because I already drank it and I threw it in the trash. But anyways, you slide this, you know, slide, okay, the open part of your can, you slide that in there and it covers it, covers the lid. Or maybe you do it this way. I think you do it that way. Or no, because the arrow's on my top. You do it that way. So, you know, if, you have, if you're out and about and you have canned drinks and you don't want any bugs in your drinks, I say get these. I don't know if they work, so don't hold me responsible for that. Because I don't know. But I'm going to try it. And they were 68 cents. Really? For all those? 68 cents for all of them. Will I ever use them? I don't know. But I thought I would. Alright, then I got a 10-piece waterproof card holder protector. Okay, our insurance cards, they come in hard paper. They used to laminate them, but they don't anymore. So I got us some of these. Oh, wait. Let me see what they are. Oh, yeah, you can cut them. Okay, you would cut them. You slide it in there, and then it's at least protected by this. So, and you just cut them off. Be very careful. Oh, Lord. You know that little cutting knife that I got? That's what I'm going to cut it with. I won't do it. I'll have Jeff do it. Because I know me, I'll cut in the card and then I'll destroy it and then everything will be a mess. But anyways, I like those and I'm going to try them. And they were 99 cents for these whole thing. Um, yeah, I'm going to cut mine. I just want for like my insurance card and I think I had something else I wanted to cover. And then I got an ultra fine mesh strainer. I got these for my blackberries when I do them in the fall. We get them in there and then we push and push and squeeze and squeeze. I got different ones. I'm going to try them all out this year. See which one I like the best. Boy, this one looks really good because it doesn't have it even have holes. It's just like a silk. It's got to go through. The, it'll be just the juice because I like to deep get our seeds out. Sometimes I do. Sometimes I don't. But sometimes when you're eating blackberry jam or jelly, I hate that when I bite down and it's there and I don't know it. But anyways, I got this and it was $1.39. Okay, and then Ultra Fine Mesh Strainer. Well, this was 99 cents, so I will be using this instead of my hand. How professional I was. <laughs> That's how unprofessional I am. I hope my family don't watch it. Just use your fist, cram the blackberries down. Okay, family, I'm going to strain them like this. I have a tool now. <laughs> oh, Lord. You guys just know I'm just down-earth country girl. <laughs> That's why my mom did it. <laughs> but, yeah, <laughs> there we go. I wondered what that little thing was. I was like, what is that? I've already forgot. It was $1.39, too. Um, oh, no, wait. I took that back. It was 99 cents. I was looking at the um, strainer. All right. And then a single carrying bag for Delta Cable. I got it in purple and it was 86 cents. These are really nice, guys. I mean, for 86 cents, you could put anything in here. See, you, it, the zipper's nice, it zips it up. There's no outside pockets. And in the inside, you know how you're going somewhere and you might wanna put your medicines? Now, I don't mean single medicines. I've got a medicine thing and I think the whole thing would fit in here or put it in something smaller, slide it in there and then over here. And they said, like, um, for charging heads, your headset, stuff like that. But you could use this for anything. This would even be a nice gift. Um, 86 cents is what I said. Yep, 86 cents. Then, what is this? 
an upgrade your charging experience. Oh, this was the, let me see what size I got. I think I got the nine feet. Uh, $1.99. And let me just see how long, because I've got mine charged up now. And I'm going to see if it's longer than that one. Because that would be awesome, because that would give me just a little bit more um, length. I wanted to tell you guys that I appreciate you guys so much. Your comments come about at the right time. Oh, wow. You guys, look. Oh, my gosh. I can plug into the wall and go over there. Wow. Freedom. Freedom. Oh, sorry. I never said I was a singer. So, there. <laughs> but that's cool. I like that. I might get another one. $1.99. I might get another one of those. Wow. That'll be awesome. And then I picked up a few more buttons. I think these were just buttons that I had already ordered that um, came in late. And they were 98 cents. And you get 30 of them. Okay. Then I got... Oh, got to slide over here a little bit. I got... A set of four dish brush set with storage holder. Um, it says kitchen, but you could use this anywhere, especially if you wanted to use it for house. But I would definitely label it or say this is for the bathroom or this is for the kitchen. Whatever. I mean, if you're going to use it in the kitchen, of course, just set it in there. But if I'm going to use it for anything else, because it was like, it mentioned a few things. And it was $8.49. And I think this is a scrub when you put water on it. I think it might get a little bigger. And I think that's what the scrub brush sits in. So I might put it up on my counter because I have brushes in a basket now and I might take those out. But what it is, is this was the holder. And if I remember correctly, you could order the wood handle or the plastic handle. And I ordered the wood. And so like, uh, let me see. I don't want to break it or anything. Okay, that's the way it would go in. So you'd slide that in there, do your dishes. You could can use it on your dishes this would be even a nice cleansing tool i don't know guys i might use this as a cleanser but i'll definitely mark it because i don't want to use it cleaning you know like my house and then do dishes with it definitely not that and then here's this one pop it in there see i mean yeah you could do your dishes with this but i really don't see me doing dishes with this i use my sponges and stuff and, and throw them out i'm really thinking i'm going to use this on cleaning And then, and well, this one's more, I don't know. I might keep like this one in the kitchen because this would be more like your bottle or my cans. Yeah, that one I might leave in there. But those other ones, those would be good cleaning. If I could get them apart. And then everything goes right on this little tray and we'll off. So I don't know what I'll do with mine yet. But what I say, I think it was like $8, but I had to have... A discount on this yeah I did um, yeah but it's 849 and then I got a cute pumpkin shirt you know how I always go back and forth to an extra large to a 2x I don't know why or yeah extra large or a 2x um, I don't know why I do that I got this in an extra large and I wish I'd have got a 2x it fits it will fit you know my, you know it's cute and it'll fit but I just always am worried about the washing and it's shrinking. Fall, y'all. And then, oh, I just love this shirt. Um, and I love these colors. 60% um, polyester, 35 rayon, and 5 spandex. These have not been shrinking. So I think I'll be okay with this. But I get the 2X for now because if there is any possible shrinkage, then um, I don't worry about it. Because if I get an extra large, I'm always like, oh no, if it shrinks just a little bit. And plus, remember, I don't like my shirts tight. So, that was $7.19. Then I got these little ribbons. I had ordered these before, and I think they're just now coming. They came with this package. It's just like a ribbon. If I'm a little shaky, it's because I took my prednisone. Um, it comes like in a little ribbon. You can use them like this, or you can cut them and just use them as one little little flower and those were a dollar 47 and it says you can use them on clothing shoes um really anything you want to sew them onto 
and that's kind of what I use them for. I just use them for a variety of things. And then a little diamond, diamond painting tray set, seven in one. It was $4.49, and it looks like this. You take the lid off. I haven't, I've got some diamond paintings, but I haven't done mine yet. I'm anxious to get started. All these little squares come out. And you can put your diamonds all in there. You can use this tray if you want to. I just thought it was the cutest little thing. And it's purple. It's pretty purple. And you get the brush, I think, to kind of... I, I don't really know what you do with the brush. But then here's your little scoop and a spoon. And then you put your little lid on there. And like if you're diamond painting... Was that the right way? Yeah. And if you're diamond painting, you can put this on there and put it over to the side and you should be good to go. And what I say, $4.49. Not bad. Then I got a rain barrel cover. It protects and collects rainwater. Now we don't have, and it's weird because on the paper it shows two, but I got one. I thought I was buying two, but I think it's one of those things. It just says rain barrel cover. So I think I just looked at it and took it as wrong. So $4.49. We don't have this yet, but I'm really thinking about doing it. You know, especially for like outdoor things. Um, you know, have it or water in our um, garden. Uh, but it comes this big, guys. I thought in the paper, I thought it would be this little. And I was like, okay, you're wasting your money. You're wasting your time. But this is huge. This will actually go over a barrel. And it's got the pool string and this little thing on there. So that's not bad at all. So that would actually go over a barrel. But you know how they always say to, you know, you want, you don't want to collect like the dirt and stuff. You just want the water. So that would be going through that. So this is awesome. I might go back and get me another one. I might check Amazon, see what they have, see what their cost is. And if their cost is less than $4.97 for one, I might get it through Amazon. But if it's not, then I'm going to order me another one. Because I don't know why. I just think if I had one in the front and one in the back. Because we got the garden in the back and my flower garden. My fairy garden and everything is up here. So I'd like to have two barrels in both places. So that would be really neat. And I would love that. And that's really the reason why I would want that. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I've put my sheet down somewhere else. Well, I still have... Hmm. Let me go back. Let me go back. Okay. Alrighty. Let me show you these. I don't think this is a runner. Um, I know this is Valentine's Day. And you know, I'm obsessed with runners. I'm mean, really obsessed. <laughs> but um, I got these. These are all placemats. So when I do have that runner, instead of, it was cheaper to get the placemats than it was for me to get the runner and cut it down and sew it. So for Valentine's Day, I'm gonna put these out because remember I got the runner to match these. So now I have these and two runners. So normally I take the runners and see, they do exactly what I would be doing. I cut it off and then I fold back the edges and there you go. Theirs is probably more professional than mine. But, and I did get, oh gosh, I need one. There's two, three. Oh, okay, I got two sets of four. Okay, that's plenty. I was getting ready to say, oh no, I need more than that. I have about eight places where I put seven to eight. Um, okay, guys, I just have one more thing. Okay, I showed that yesterday. I have one more thing, and I thought it was on my paper, and it wasn't. And I want to say we've had popcorn poppers, and we've gotten rid of them. And because everything was microwave. Well, my brother, he always raised corn for popcorn, for popping corn. Excuse me. And um, I always, I got the little thing that you fill it up, you put it in the microwave. It's like a mac microwave one. If anybody wants to see it, let me know because you can get it from, I either got it from Walmart or Amazon. I'm thinking Walmart. I want to, but I ordered a lot of stuff from Amazon. I can't remember. Oh, well. Um, but anyways, um, so we always just put it in that, put it in the microwave, and everything is done through the microwave. And you know, when we went to that Barbie movie and I got the popcorn from the popper, I was just like, oh, I really want that. So I went and ordered me a mini, 
a mini joy. <laughs> I thought I was going to say mini popcorn. <laughs> mini popcorn popcorn. And then mini joy. Because it's going to give me minty of joy. Or mini of joys. I don't know. Okay, I screwed that up. Um, snack maker. Healthy and tasty. Oil free. Um, hot air corn pop. Or pop corn maker. Um, that's about it. It did come with instructions. I should do a, a review on this and actually make the popcorn. That would be fun. Okay, we got the measuring cup. I can see you. We got the top cover. I can really see you there. I hope I'm making you laugh. Uh, <laughs> oh wait, is that the top cover? Okay, that was the top cover. And then, plastic body. I got red. I don't know if that's the only color it came in. But, it says, alright, so let me put this together. Gosh, it's so long since I have even done this. I don't even remember. Okay, it looks like, oh, that's not in its little spot. Hold on. Everything snaps in, Amy, if you just take your time. Okay, so this is the way it looks, and here's the on and off button. And it looks like you're supposed to. Um, add salt oil in the box. Okay, so I'm thinking it doesn't say how much popcorn. Hold on. It's just showing this little thing and it's saying add the salt oil cream to the box. But this little thing's supposed to have a lid. Maybe it's supposed to have a lid. Maybe mine don't. I don't see it. I did open it in some kind of frantic way. Maybe it doesn't. I don't know what that is. It looks like a... It doesn't have a lid over here. It just says measuring cup. I thought we put it on top. Oh, maybe you use this as the... Measuring cup. Oh, maybe they're just using it as a measuring cup. Okay, I was thinking it had holes in it, and that's what your stuff was going to melt onto your corn. Okay. Okay, so you use it as a measuring cup, and then... It looks like they're popping it thin. You put it on here. I'm confused. Okay. You put everything in there. Then you dump it in. Leave the lid on. Plug it in. And it pops. Maybe? What you guys think? Thumbs up? Or thumbs down? I think that's it. It doesn't really, it just says do not add any salt, oils, and creams to the machine. Oh. This is a safety alert. Okay, I guess you only want to add your popcorn to the machine. Might have been nice if I uh, watched this before. Take the cup. Fill and fill in the machine with one cup of corn and only one cup of corn. Fit the cup and the upper cover onto the machine. Okay, so you put the cup back on there and then turn it on. After powered three minutes, the hot popcorn comes out of the outlet. Push the switch off. And that is you can use this as your, put your cream and your salt and melt it down and pour it over there. Or maybe it melts on top of it. I don't know. I'll probably just put it in a little cup and do it in the microwave. Okay. All right. So there we go. Okay. So you could put, I don't, it says put a cup. I'll probably just try it out first. I'll probably put a cup of this because there is a little thing down there that says max. So I'll probably fill this up, pour it in there. And if it comes to the max, then I'll know to use this every time. And I will put my lid on there. Because I think it will hold the heat in maybe a little bit better. 
and then I'll turn it on. And it's going to be like, it's not going to be a lot. It'll be like a cup. I'll probably have to make two for me and Jeff. But easy, convenient, easy to clean. I don't know. And it's fun just for, um, you know, you know, a night of popcorn. And yeah, the microwave is a lot easier. And it'll probably taste better. No, because it'll be my brother's popcorn. So his is going to be better. So, and really the instructions, I don't need it because, heck, I know how to make popcorn. All right, guys. Oh, and I got to, I don't know how much that cost. It wasn't on my cost sheet. I was thinking it was like maybe 10 or $13, maybe. That's what I'm thinking. I'm not for sure. All right, guys, I'm getting ready to head out of here because I got another video to make. This is my link. I know it's backwards. I'll try to do better. And please forgive me for not being professional and knowing how to do this. But here's my link if you want to order. And I honestly don't know what kind of deal you get. I even hate to say because I'm not 100% for sure. So um, let me do some investigating. If you guys know, um, somebody, I did have a comment from a viewer that they gave me a name of someone that's a, on, t, um, on YouTube that is an influencer and uh, affiliated with Timu. So I might go to her and ask. I just haven't had a chance to. But that's it for my video. Put a smile on your face. You'll put a smile on somebody else's face. And you'll both be happy. Get it? B, my little B. Where's a B? I don't have any Bs. I, I don't have any Bs right now around me. Okay, fine. But you'll be happy. They'll be happy. And it's a win-win situation. All right, guys. Have a good evening. And I've had fun doing this today. And I know I'm a little goofy and maybe a little annoying, but... I feel good today, so, and I want to show it. All right. Love you guys. God bless.